scripture today comes from Genesis chapter 29, beginning in verse 10 and going through verse 20. Before I read these verses, I want to give you the background, the history for these verses. This is the story of Jacob, and Jacob's story is about a very long trip, a very long journey. He was born in one land, and then he had to travel a very long way and live in another land like many have, of you have done. Many of you have been born in one place, and then you've had to travel a very long way and live in a strange place. And that is what Jacob had to do. Jacob had to do it. His reason was different. He had to run away from his brother because his brother wanted to kill him. Uh, he had uh, stolen his father's birthright. He had stolen the blessing. Um, and he, when he went away, he had nothing. He had to run for his life, and so he had no money, he had no help, he was all alone. In his mind, he was all alone on this long journey. Um, and so he, he starts out on this journey, the very long journey, and he finally comes to his mother's brother, and he comes to a place of safety. Um, and that is where we see the story. Beginning in verse 10, this is God's word. When Jacob saw Rachel, daughter of Laban, his mother's brother, Laban and Laban's sheep, he went over and rolled away the stone from the mouth of the well and watered his uncle's sheep. Then Jacob kissed Rachel and began to, to cry out loud. He told her that he was a relative of her father and the son of Rebekah. So she ran and told her father. As soon as Laban heard the news about Jacob, his sister's son, he hurried to meet him. He embraced him and kissed him and brought him to his home. And there Jacob told him all these things. Then Laban said to him, you are my own flesh and blood. After Jacob had stayed with him for a whole month, Laban said to him, just because you are a relative of mine, should you work for me for nothing? Tell me what your wages should be. How much should you earn? Now Laban had two daughters. The name of the older was Leah, and the name of the younger was Rachel. Leah had weak eyes, but Rachel was lovely in form and beautiful. Jacob was in love with Rachel and said, I will work for you for seven years in return for your daughter Rachel. Laban said, It is better that I give her to you in marriage than to some other man. Stay with me. So Jacob served seven years to get Rachel, but they seemed to him like a few days because of his love for her. This is God's word. Would you pray with me? 